in your folder is your lectura page for the week. And you practice this every day with your big person, whoever your big person is today. You need to read this to them, okay? Now, up here is the story Jig and the Pig. Down here is Kiss a Pig. Maybe some of you remember these stories from last year. So I will start reading to show you how I want you to learn to read. So we want to learn to read so it sounds interesting, right? So our story is, oops, that's not our story. Our story is Jig and Mag. Now this is the title. This is the title. And up here, up here, same thing. Jig and Mag tells you what our story is about. In a title, the important words are in big letters. See down here too, kiss a pig. Important words are kiss and pig. Uh, is, no, that's not important. Okay. But also, these are names, and names always, in English, always, always, always get a capital letter. So here's our story, Jig and Mag. Now, which one do you think is Jig? Is Jig the pig or is Jig the dog? Who do you think? Which one is Mag? Is Mag the pig or is Mag the dog? Hmm. Well, here, I'll give you a hint. His name is under him. And also, Jig and Pig rhyme. Okay, they, what they sound like. Jig, pig, wig, pig, dig. Okay, so let's go for our story. Jig is a big pig. Oh, he is big, isn't he? Jig can dig and dig. Now, pigs like to dig in the mud. And the reason pigs dig in the mud is because pigs don't sweat like you do and like I do. It's hot. It's hot, and we sweat, and that's the way God made us, so it helps to cool us down. Now, here's what I want you to do. I want you to lick your hand. Lick it. Now blow on it. See how that's cooler? Okay, this hand. This hand. See, this hand is cooler when you blow on it. Okay, God made us that way. We sweat. We sweat to help cool us down. Pigs don't do that. Only on their feet. Now, my feet sweat sometimes. And pee they stink. Well, pigs only sweat on their feet. So they dig in the mud to get all wet. So they cool down. That's why they do it. But the mud that they dig around in, they poop in it and they pee in it to help make mud. And that's nasty. And that's why pigs are nasty and dirty and nasty. And they stink and they have lots of germs. And then they eat stuff that gets in there, and then they eat that poop. And So you have to be really careful when you eat cerdo so you don't get sick. It has to be cooked really well. But anyway, back to our story about Jig and the pig. Jig can dig and dig. Mag can dig and dig. Dogs also like to dig. We had a story, and we'll be doing that in a few weeks maybe, about the diggingous dog. Do you remember that one? Well, we'll have that one later. Did Jay win? Did Mag win? Who made the biggest hole? Who do you think? Whose hole's bigger? Who, whose hole's better? <gasps> Jig did win. See, there's his ribbon. He's the winner. Yay, Jig! Jig and Mag ran. Mag can tag Jig. Tok toka. Mag did win. Mag is the fastest, faster runner. Pigs can run, but not, not like dogs can, and not for a long time. Pigs are very dangerous. They will bite, and they can they can bite your arm off. So stay away from the pigs, right? Okay, so now let's take our papers and we're gonna read the top. 
Ready? Let's read it together. Okay, the title is, read it with me, please. Jig and Mag. Okay, down to number one. Jig is a big pig. Jig can dig and dig. Number three, Mag can dig and dig. Number four, did Jig win? Now, do you hear how my voice goes up? Because it's a question, pregunta. It's a question. So when we ask a question, our voice goes up. It's just how we talk. Did Jig win? Did Mag win? Who won? Number five, Jig did win. Jig and Mig, Jig and Mag ran. Mag can tag Jig. Mag did win. Okay, there's the first story. Now we're going to do the story on the bottom. Okay, we see there, kiss a pig. Remember this one? Kiss a pig. Kiss a pig. I can fit a mitt. Now this word mitt is on your reading list. It's on your reading list. A mitt is a ball glove. And see how it has two T's on the end. If you see that on your reading list, that, that's it. Mitt, a ball mitt. I can mix a bit. Little girl and her daddy are mixing up something. What do you think it is? If you look really, really closely, it's chocolate chip cookies. Mm, yummy! I love chocolate chip cookies when we make them ourselves. Chips Ahoy, they're okay. But if you make them yourself in the in your the orno in your oven, mm, nice warm and the chocolate's so See, I can dig. Oh, that's right. I'm, I can dig a pit. I can sit in it. Look at that picture there. The little girl's digging a hole, and she's sitting in it. That's a deep hole, isn't it? Especially with her little shovel. I can fix a wig. I hid the pins. Okay, this here is a wig. And that's one of the words on your list, too. Little payaso. The pins are the part that you use to keep your hair in place. Yes, she hides the pins. I don't know what you call them in Spanish. Oh, I can hit, I can hit a, a lid. The lid, the lid right here. The lid is the top of the pan. I can hit a lid. Is the lid tin? Is this metal tin? Probably aluminum, not a tin pot. I can hit to win. Uh-oh. I can miss a hit. Swing. Miss. Oh, and there's miss, one of those words that has two S's at the end. In English, we have some words that are spelled funny like that. We don't we don't memorize them. After you see them a lot, you just automatically know how they're spelled. But there's miss, miss. Can I? Oops, come back here. Can I kiss a pig? No. I quit. Okay, there's that Q U quit. I quit. No mas. No mas. Okay. Quit means to stop doing something. Now remember, in English, we have Q and U always go together in English. Spanish does too. Okay, but we pronounce it like K W. KW, quit. You, in Spanish, you would use Q, U, like cuidado, cuando, cuatro, okay? That Q, U has the C, U sound in Spanish. I quit. So, 
let's take our papers now, and this time you're going to read with me. Ready? Kiss a pig. I can fit a mitt. You reading with me? I can mix a bit. I can dig a pit. I can sit in it. Are you reading with me? Saudi, are you reading? How about you, Dariel? Are you reading with me? Everybody out loud, don't just look at the words. Uh, number four, I can fix a wig. I hid the pins. Number five, I can hit a lid. Is the lid tin? I can hit to win. I can miss a hit. Number seven. I can sit on a hill. Hill. Make sure you say hill. Not heel. Hill. I can sit and sit. Can I kiss a pig? No. I quit. And that's for today. You can practice this if you need to use the tape again to, to, to practice. Use the video. But make sure you read this every day to a big person. You got that? Every day this and every day your, your eye list, both sides. Okay? Every day you need to read them. Ready, have fun.